Welcome to Wolf Chevrolet. Today we're taking a closer look at some of the interior and exterior features in our 2020 Chevrolet Suburban. The Suburban is featured in a white paint finish and is the premier trim. It includes features such as heated and vented front leather bucket seats, heated second row bench seat, a power fold flat third row bench seat, power tailgate, lane keep assist, front and rear park assist, a heads up display, forward collision alert, lane keep assist, as well as much more. Starting off in the front of the vehicle, we can see we have a chrome finished door handle, power locks, below our power folding mirrors, power windows, as well as rear window locks. We have our driver's seat memory farther down along the door, as well as some storage and our Bose speaker. Just inside to the left of the steering wheel, we have our heads up display, we have the controls for our traction, park sensors, lane keep assist, and power adjustable pedals. Below that, our lighting controls, transfer case settings, as well as an integrated trailer brake controller, power tilt telescopic steering column, power driver seat finished in our jet black leather. Getting into the vehicle and looking above our steering wheel. In the center of the steering wheel, or above it, in our display cluster, we have our digital information system, which has all of our controls on the side of the steering wheel. Moving down to the left-hand side of the steering wheel, we have our cruise settings, forward collision alert, and heated steering wheel buttons. Right-hand side has our hands-free, as well as the controls for our steering wheel information system. Moving to the middle, we have our infotainment system. We have AM, FM, Sirius XM, and Bluetooth connection, available phone projection, as well as phone connection. Also can see that we have our GPS navigation. If we swipe to the right, we can also see we have apps and My Chevrolet. Putting the vehicle into reverse, we can see it functions as our backup camera with adaptive guidelines. We have additional controls across the bottom, including our volume, menu, home button, as well as radio media hotkeys. If we hit our button, we can see we can hop our screen up and down, and we have a USB in the back, as well as some storage. CD player across the bottom. Then we have our tri-zone climate control. You can see we can control the rear climate from the front, or we can lock the controls and make it controlled through the back. Push to start ignition, heated and vented front seats for driver and passenger. And across the bottom, we have some more power. We have a 12 volt plug, two USBs with some storage, our two cup holders and our cup holder. We can currently see our key. On our key, we have our locks and unlocks, a remote start, power tailgate, as well as alarm system. Center console on top, a wireless charging pad. Inside, we can see we have some deep storage, as well as a 12 volt plug and some more storage at the front. We also have two USBs and an auxiliary input. Passenger seat is also finished in our jet black leather, heated and vented and powered for the passenger. Lastly, moving above our rear view mirror, on the outside, we have our dome lighting controls, universal garage door opener, controls for our power tailgate, controls for our dome lighting on if they turn on when the door is open, as well as our sunglass holder. Now walking down the side of the vehicle, moving to our front tire and rim, we have our aluminum rim with an all-terrain tire. Moving out, we have chrome finished mirror caps, paint match door handles with chrome accents, as well as a black molded assist step all the way around to the back of the vehicle. We have our black Chevrolet bow tie, suburban and premier badging in chrome. Power tailgate, our button is right in the center. Backup camera below our Chevrolet bow tie. In the back of the vehicle, we can see we have some storage space, 6040 power folding third rear bench seat. Underneath, you can see we have some more storage. On the passenger side, we can fold our seats. We also have a 12 volt plug. As mentioned, we have a power fold. Then lastly, to close the rear of the vehicle, we have our handle as well as our button on the passenger side. Moving into the back of the vehicle, you can see we have a chrome finished door handle. 
Below we have our power window control, as well as some storage, and our Bose speaker and the rest of the door. Inside the vehicle we have storage pockets in the back of the driver and passenger seat. Between the front two seats we have a 120 volt plug, as well as a 12 volt plug. We have our heated rear outboard seats, as well as all of our tri-zone air conditioning controls. You can also see we have some storage in the bottom. Moving to the seats themselves, we have three of them in the second row, finished in a 60-40 folding bench. In our center seat, we have two foldable cup holders with some storage. You can fold the outboard seats down the side. Once folded, we have some access to our third row, which is also a 60-40 bench in a power fold setting. On either side, we have cup holders as well as a 12 volt plug on the driver side, cup holder on the passenger side, as well as some more storage. On the roof, we have our lights as well as our vents in the rest of the vehicle. Thank you for joining me for this quick video walk around of the 2020 Chevrolet Suburban. If you enjoyed, please be sure to subscribe for more daily videos and we hope to see you at Wolf Chevrolet soon.